blessed with another year of life. Leading up to my birthday, I have been feeling all sorts of feelings and emotions I cannot fully understand. There are questions of uncertainty, lack of motivation, and wondering to myself, am I doing enough with my life? This question always lingers at the end of the day when I'm by myself. There are a lot of moments needing to spend time alone, connecting with myself and trying to fully understand and give answers to these emotions. And I have realized the answer. We humans don't always have it all together in life. Life will always surprise us with the most unexpected things and it's by embracing each moment that will enable us to be grateful for the life we have created for ourselves. Having spent the past few days with the right people, all questions were answered. This year has been an eye-opener having found myself a family within the little community we have built ourselves online. Meeting new people, people who are dreamers, who are hard workers, and people who genuinely want the best of each other. 22 years of life had many many ups and downs, but this is the life I have created for myself and this is just the beginning of a wonderful and fulfilling life I dream for myself. Grateful for all the opportunities, for the love of my family, and all the life moments I will cherish forever. Here's to all the dreamers, may we continue to create the life we dream of, may we not get lost on the way, no matter what it takes, we will get there. Good morning everyone! If you're new to my channel, my name is Alex and today I'm with my friends Zoe and Za, Jan and Anne and obviously Chino here at Sikihor. But as you would have seen in the clips yesterday, it was my birthday. So we're actually going to be here in Sikihor for about six days with my friends. And yes, yeah, so we're staying here right now at Mandala Tribe Treehouse. I really want to quickly show you what it looks like because it's really nice here. So I want to show you here from the front of our room it looks so nice like the path there's so much um, trees around and it's actually very serene like it's so quiet it's so peaceful I think there's about six or seven bungalows or tree houses and you're like in a circle but it, there's it's so private because there's so many trees around so you don't really see the other rooms okay so you walk in and you see the tree house and let's go in my favorite part actually is that door right there and there's chino there's actually a swing set right here which is so fun um it's really breezy out here so you can definitely stay and chill by the chairs as well but let's go and see the shower how nice is that there's also some plants in there and the shower. There's a mirror right here. This is where I was getting ready before. And then there's the toilet. But I really want to shoot like a photo here or something. This is really cool. I've actually kind of never really stayed at a villa with an outdoor shower before. 
So this one's really fun. This is my first time and I actually really love it. I always see it on like Instagram, um, Facebook and now I have it and I really can't wait to take photos and videos right here. It's such a picturesque spot. And we're now going to go to the room tour, which is upstairs. So let's go up. So the room now is here. So here's the room. It fits two people and it's actually really spacious. So that's really good. And then you have windows as well. And you can close those blinds, obviously, when you're sleeping. Another mirror right here, which is handy. But yeah, look how spacious this space is. And they also have AC right there. And a closet right here. So you pretty much just have everything you need in this room. You have a comfy bed, AC, which is a must in the Philippines. It's always so warm. So having AC is always good. And you have a closet and just a spacious room in general. But yeah, this place is really nice. I'm so glad I got to stay here. So I'm staying at Mandela Tribe Treehouse here in Sikihor. If you want to check them out, I can put the link down below and try it for yourself. So we made it here at lunch. Well, we're supposed to have breakfast earlier, but now it's lunchtime. We're here at Dolce Amore. It's an Italian restaurant. And apparently all their ingredients are all from Italy. So it's all fresh. I mean, very authentic. And we, had, we were here last night for my birthday and we're just gonna eat here for lunch as well. So I'm joined by Zoe and Za. You've met them before. And Jan and Anne, you've also met them before. But yeah, this is the crew for Siki Hall. Ha, ha, ha. 